My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Hey, we've got a good old Chevelle muscle car for you right here. It's got a 383 stroker motor, four speed Muncie trans, power steering, power disc brakes. It runs strong. I put about 30 miles on it myself. I can vouch for that. If you go to volocars.com, you can read all the specs, see photos top to bottom, get the price on this one and a few hundred other collector cars. They're all for sale at volocars.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, that way you'll be notified first as these videos come out. But for now, why don't you join me and I'll take you for a spin in this 69 Chevelle. I just bought the car down in Tennessee. It's a real clean, solid car. I was just up in the trunk looking for any splices. It looks like it's the original quarter panels. Underneath the car is solid and it's smooth all along the bottoms. It's all smooth. I open the bottom of the door, the lip is real clean, the fenders all metal, the hood sits flush and square, the doors are square. I purposely left these windows up to show how nice they fit. The trunk is nice and square, so the body I think is in excellent shape. All the panels fit nice, it's straight, no vinyl top. The paint job is real nice. You look at this out on a sunny day, uh, nine out of 10 people are gonna say it's an excellent paint job. The one person out of 10 is that guy who just paid 20 grand and his car is perfect. Uh, it's not that, but it's really nice looking. Uh, maybe a, one more light wet sand would take out some little tiny imperfections. You don't even need that. Uh, it's got the 1970 style stripes painted on. Uh, but it's a nice glossy metallic green finish. Looks like a lot of chrome was replaced. The bumpers front and back, the emblems, bow tie mirrors on both sides, new door handles, new tail lights. It has new chrome Kreger 15 inch wheels, a little bit wider in the back. The tires look like they're new. Here's a scratch right here that's touched up, I just noticed. This is original, the grill's in good original condition. Three eighty three stroker. It's got a polished aluminum high rise intake, Holly carb with an electric choke, HEI ignition. It's got a set of headers, and it really runs strong. I drove this home and I drove it around that evening. It's, it starts up. I you know shut it off, started it, no problem. Shifted nice, stopped nice, drove down the road nice. Uh, so really a great driving car. The four speed is, it feels real good. Got the original style bezel around the floor, uh, new carpet, new sill plates, jams are glossy, new weather strip. It is a light tint on the glass. It's an empty trunk compartment, but it's all clean metal. So it's all solid and nice. This is painted nice. The weather strip is new. It's got a nice dual exhaust with the cowbell exhaust tips. Underneath the car, the front end is all rebuilt, the ball joints, bushings, uh, and back it's got new air shocks, uh, the springs and shocks uh, look new. The interior is all redone, all new upholstery, new reproduction door panels, new armrests. The whole instrument panel is real nice, the heater controls, the gauges, the chrome, uh, the dash pad, all that's real nice. It does have a retro stereo fit right into the factory hole. There's two new six by nine speakers back here. Back to the motor compartment, uh, very clean and tidy. There's not a lot of extra, no clutter. Uh, the wires are run neatly. Um, I say it has power steering, power brakes, got the fan shroud, chrome alternator, chrome uh, bracket, just smooth, clean, tidy. Bottom of the hood's painted black, has new insulation. So just a nice motor compartment. But why don't we fire it up for you? It's got new, uh, when you look up at the bottom of the motor, it still looks fresh. The bottom of the motor is clean, the starter, it's got a Muncie four speed. 
Uh, it's got a 10 bolt rear end in there. New uh, U joints. Visors, the mirror look new, the dome light works. Everything fits nice. A lot of times these hoods will ride up on the fenders and scratch them. Everything just shut nicely. And get, getting back to the way it drove, really, I, I mean it. I drove this and it functioned really well. And it gets up and goes. It's got some, some oomph. You want to take off with the light, it'll do it and it'll sound good. But then you click it in that fourth gear, this thing just cruise nicely. 60 miles an hour, just effortless. Uh, cruising. So just an all-around really nice muscle car Chevelle. You don't have to spend a million dollars. It's a nice clean piece I think anyone could be proud of. Visit volocars.com. Plenty of ways on there to contact our staff. They're here to help you answer any questions or concerns about the car, about financing, about delivery. If you enjoy watching our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. You'll be the first to see them when they come out. Appreciate everyone who's been watching and hope you come back for more.